Hello, welcome to this podcast. My name is Beatrice Mars. I am a human being making music. So the time has come. That's the only way to put it. And uh, and the, the the real thing is that my uh, my hard disk is not too full, so I can record today and talk about the subject I'm about to talk to you about, which is the last album. Uh, I said I was going to do it. I wasn't sure, but. As I said before, and I'm uh, now I have to say it again, the my last album uh, called uh, the Triple X Factor was something which was uh, very close to my heart, and uh, I have to say that for several months I had some trouble listening to some of the tracks because uh, tears were pouring out. That's the only that's the only way uh, I, I could uh, I could do it, and when uh, and when uh, it came to a point where I, um. I spent several months not listening to some of the tracks at all. So that's the reason why I didn't actually talk about it that much. And today I'm here to talk about it because uh, thinking about it a little a little bit longer, it's true that uh, it's not that I'm, uh, I'm over it, but the pain that is associated with this album, it's... Uh, it's it's not it's, it's not that it's, it is gone, but it's not that strong anymore. Uh, I can deal with it much better so as well i thought well uh, let's talk about this album so no more excuses let's talk about this album especially since i've done it for um, the last three so i have to do it for 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 for, for this album so let's talk about track uh, well track number one the uh, actually which is doing well on one side uh the name of the is is can stop won't stop and uh, basically, it's all about that track. It's all about a point in my life where uh, the money was draining out, and uh, I did not have the, uh, the the expected results. So I was a bit uh, kind of scared and uh, happy to do what I was doing, but very scared indeed. And then, um, and then it came to a point where I said, "Well, really, I can't stop." And I won't stop because I can't stop because if I do it now, I will stop. I will continue to stop doing the things that don't work. And uh, I won't stop because this is what I want to do. So basically, I'm going to do it, namely making music. The second track is called, is in French, it's called L'Etincelle, which is a sparkle in English. And uh, basically, I'm just say, I'm just thinking about the fact that uh, it took me a lot of time to realize that... Uh, Music was my the main thing in my life, the most important thing in my life. And uh, if I wanted to be happy, I should make music. Whatever happened, regardless of of the fact that people may like it or not like it, I should just make music, and that's all. That's about it. And uh, the other one, the third track is called "Le Troll de Service," which is a uh, you know the the troll actually, uh, you know. And uh, it's just that uh, sometimes, and I think maybe you, you you understand what I'm saying is that sometimes I just feel like, I feel like I'm a troll because I'm not doing things people are usually doing. I'm not thinking the way people are are thinking. Well, I think people are thinking. I'm thinking, uh, uh, and right now I'm making music in a weird way somehow, uh, but maybe not so weird. That's what I discovered re- recently. So I don't know. I, I like to call myself a troll in the music world. If you see, if you see, if you understand what I'm saying. And the other one is called um, Les Jours Passent. The days are passing by. And uh, basically it's about like uh, missing someone you love. And uh, in in general, I know uh, the way I've, I've, um, I'm singing it in, in that song is that it's more like um, a love affair. But usually uh, the main the tattoo is, uh, yes... The days are getting by because, uh, yes, you realize that someone is missing in your life and uh, there's no turning back to what it was before because now the thing is just done and you have to deal with it. And uh, the other track is called, it's the fifth track, it's called Trois Petits Tours, Three Little, three, three little Tricks. And uh, it just, it's just me talking about the fact that... Um, it's it's, a, it's disguised in the song which is in French, 
but uh, it's just me saying that uh, whatever whatever I do, I, it just seems to me that I just like fall back into 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 the right places, and uh, even though sometimes totally de destabilized, I'm just going back to it. And then the sixth draft is my is it's called la musique. The music it's just my it's just to express my love of music the way I'm feeling about music and the way the way I do thing. There's another track called Exclu, which is uh, kind of I think it's excluded in English, but uh, I'm not sure it's the right translation. But uh, basically, it's all about that the fact that uh, for a very long time I felt like I was left alone in, and excluded from a life, uh, like a bit like an er hermit, but uh, or prisoner, a secluded prisoner. You had it the right secluded prisoner. I'm just kind of. Disguising the fact that yeah, I, I felt like like a secluded uh, prisoner, and then there's another track in French called Le Soir, which is uh, at night, and basically it was like uh, I was so stressed up at one point that I just couldn't sleep at night, and uh, I I know that I've disguised this desk is not, but the, the theme underneath it just that uh, yeah, uh, because I was so worried I couldn't sleep, and that was. What was it? And there's another track, another track called uh, "I Am I Am a Woman." Je suis une femme in French. It's just that uh, people when they see me, well, uh, it's 50, 50, 50, 50 Some people think I'm a man, and then I'm a woman, and I can't deny the fact that I'm a woman. I'm just pleased to say that I'm a woman. I'm a woman. I like being a woman, and that's that's about it. And I don't believe that uh, because you are a woman, you should dress in certain ways and. Uh, actually flaunt your advantages if if you have any advantages apart from the fact that you are a woman and uh, if you're a man you got some uh, some advantages linked to your gender so whatever 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 and then there's another track called in english shooting for the star this one is kind of uh, on um, on spotify just going just fine and it's all about the fact that uh, uh yeah you, you have a dream and i know uh I know that's that's a phrase that I'm saying in a song. Yes, you have a dream, and sometimes you have to go for your dream, and you have to shoot for the stars or the moon, whatever. But it's true that, uh, and on the way to uh, to your dream, some people you you meet naysayers saying, yeah, uh, you know, uh, you know, you you should be uh, you should be just pleased with what you got, and you shouldn't look for better things or do other things or maybe uh, yes whatever so i think you've got the gist of it and uh, that's all about sh shooting for the stars and it's a strange song because i don't know why and how i manage that it's a bit like a country type of song and i was meant to do any country type of song but i don't know how it just came out like that and i found it so funny that uh, i have to um i have to i have to leave it that way and there's another track called pas de detour there's no way uh no way to to turn around actually um I think in English you actually say you actually use the word uh, detour, and uh, and the thing is uh, that's why I'm saying in French that uh, sometimes in life you feel like you 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 can't your your back is against the wall and uh, you know that uh, you can't go any further you just stuck there and whatever is gonna come up to you to to you you have to handle the punches the kicks and everything and. Uh, and uh, stand strong in your faith. That's what I can say. And there's another strange, strange, strange track, which is called "What Have I Done?" So, what have I done? Uh, it's really a, a, a very sarcastic view of life in general. But uh, really, the, the main thing to me is what have I done? I, I describe the fact that uh, I'm saying. Uh, I, that's me in a mess I'm saying to myself what have I done what if what and basically I just like that phrase stuck, is stuck so it's recorded but actually um, if you listen to a song it's it, there's a different a very sarcastic and different meaning but really the, the, the main thing was that uh, what have I done I'm stuck I'm going nowhere there's no 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 and in the tunnel what have I done and there's another trail called and uh, si je suis personne, if I'm nobody, that's the uh, translation. Basically, uh, when people are ignoring you and getting passive, aggressive with you and being nasty with you, 
and you wonder and they don't analyze you and uh, you realize that uh, you don't need to listen to those naysayers because we're gonna fuck you up es- excuse me for the for the language and you, you need to actually carry on and realize that you are who you are and because you are who you are you just you just you just you just are entitled to your life that's all, that's all about it and the last one which is the one that, that was causing me trouble it's Uh, je pleure in French, which is I'm crying. Basically, I'm just over that track. I'm just crying over the um, the loss, the loss of my mother. That's the only way to to actually um, put it because that's the real truth. 2018 wasn't a good year just for that. But uh, yeah, it was difficult. And um, basically, the last two tracks sounds a bit similar because usually, actually, it was one track. And then when I listened to it, the different part, I say, uh, I said to myself, well. It should be two tracks. Don't leave it because I'm. Uh, in terms of music, I felt like there was it was meant to be two tracks, and basically these are the two tracks that I've written um, after I've learned about the, the, the death of my mother, and it just turned out this way, and. Uh, And I thought that I, I wouldn't be able to write them. And then I sat down one day and uh, one track came up and then I divided them. And this is how it actually turned up. So that's about it. It's really uh, strict. It's really fast. But that's the only way I can talk about this album. I cannot say no more. And then it's just... Uh, Uh, as far as I'm, as far as I can say, now that I've talked a little bit about about it, it's for you to actually uh, enjoy the album, enjoy the tracks, and uh, whatever we happen with it in uh, in the future. Now that I'm starting to actually see the start the the, the start for the um, for the live streaming, so whatever is gonna happen to this album, actually, I'm just fine with it because uh, at the end of the day, I, I always say it, but I'm just glad that anybody is there, somebody is listening to my music. And for some cases, especially for that track, that track called uh, Can't Stop, Won't Stop, people are, it seems that the few people who are actually listening to that, mu- to that track actually enjoy it and come back to listen to it over and over again. So thank you very much because, if, ah, well, actually, It sounds deep, that track, but it is deep indeed. So thank you, thank you, thank you. So that's about it. So as usual, there's going to be a YouTube video. And uh, I will post it maybe over the weekend or after week, the weekend. I'm not too sure about it. Uh, even though I know that we, uh, this podcast will be on tonight. So, so... So I have to say I like to do them, but I'm I usually defeated by my computer because I w- haven't got enough uh, hard disk space and uh, I don't know how to do how to go about it and uh, I need to rethink about it this year and hopefully I will make I will make more podcasts and everything and more videos on my music for you to enjoy. Till then, I would like to thank you for listening to me and uh, well, you hear from me uh, how pretty soon. See you. Bye. Thank you.